So we started our trip from uh, the coastal resort town of uh, or the island of Santorini, a beautiful place uh, to kickstart uh, our honeymoon adventures. Greece has been open for travellers from the UAE since May 2021 and also recognises the Sinopharm vaccine to allow quarantine-free travel. So we packed our bags and headed off to the airport to see what the travel experience is like during the pandemic. At the check-in, we were asked to produce a negative PCR test. Though it is not required by Greece for vaccinated travellers, it is always best to get it done before you fly out. At the boarding gate, we once again had to show our vaccine certificates as well as the passenger locator form for Greece, which includes your vaccination status as well as the places where you will be staying at. To make the journey easier, one can make use of the direct flight connections from the UAE to the popular Greek islands of Mykonos and Santorini. Passengers have to wear their face masks throughout the flight, and upon our arrival, the immigration team checked our passports as well as the passenger locator forms. Within a few minutes, we were out and on our way to the hotel. Yeah, well, where where do you live? Uh, Dubai. Uh... <laughs> when dining out, the restaurant staff will be wearing the face masks. However, diners can walk in without wearing the face masks only if they're eating outdoors. However, you have to wear your face masks when going into shops or even restaurants if you are eating indoors. While you don't have to show your vaccination status when eating out, some nightlife venues may ask for it, so it is best to keep a copy with you. Other unique facilities such as the Fish Spa are open for the public. So in Greece, we stayed in the main town of Fira, of the Santorini island. Most of the stuff that you see on the postcards and the fridge magnets uh, is in Oye, the wonderful white buildings with the blue top on the churches. Uh, but the thing is that if you stay a little bit away from the touristy hotspots, you could save up. And trust me, the view at some of these hotels is exceptional. And that's the caldera that you see behind me, the volcano that created or carved this island. Up next, we make our way to Switzerland to see what travel within the Schengen zone is like. 